Okay, so I have a problem here where I want to make a certain amount of a solution with a certain freezing point given calcium chloride. One thing I want to notice right away is that calcium chloride is an electrolyte, so I'm going to need to take that into account as I go. Okay, so the equation is delta Tf, the change in freezing point, equals I times Kf times molality and calcium chloride would separate into calcium two plus ions and two chlorine minus ions, so that's three total particles, so my I would equal three. My change in freezing point would be negative 10 degrees Celsius, right, I wanted to go down by 10 degrees Celsius, and then three, and then 0.52 is the Kf of water, my molality is what I'm solving for. So I need to do 10 divided by three, divided by 0.52 in my calculator, and I get 6.41, and that's the molality, the unit comes from the Kf unit. So 6.41 molal. All right, so when I think about what that means, that means that's how many moles are in one kilogram of solvent water. So 6.41 moles of calcium chloride per one kilogram of water. What they're asking me for is liters here. So this is maybe not the perfectly written problem. I'm gonna to have to make a few assumptions because I have something about mass. But what I can say is that one kilogram of water should be about equal to one liter of water because the density of water is about one gram per milliliter. And that would be one kilogram per liter. So I can say, okay, it's about one liter, 6.41 moles of calcium chloride in one liter of water. And then as long as the calcium chloride isn't taking up much of the space, as long as most of that volume is coming from water, then that would be about one liter of solution, which is what they're asking about is liters of solution. So it's not perfect. I have to assume some things, um, but that's how I'm going to get it done. All right, so now that would mean I would have 6.41 moles of calcium chloride per one liter of water. And again, if that's negligible, 6.41 moles of calcium chloride per one liter of solution. I don't want one liter though, I want two liters, so I'll have to multiply that by two to find out how many moles of calcium chloride I need total. And I get 12.82 moles of calcium chloride total. I can't really measure moles, so I will go ahead and convert that to grams using the molar mass of calcium chloride. So I just add up the, the mass of calcium and two chlorines, and I get 110.98, or about 110. And when I multiply that, I get a pretty big number, so I went ahead and converted it to kilograms. So it was like 1,400 grams. I went ahead and converted that to 1.423 kilograms of calcium chloride in two liters of total solution.